This is How to Crochet a Ball, part 10.5, the last footage. If you watched part 11, um, I was so tired and when I was doing the voiceover for part 11, but you'll know that I thought I forgot to film the last row. And because I was so tired after posting all of the 11 parts in one sitting, except for the break where I took my son to baseball, I took a little bit of a break from posting today and instead just took the time to kind of clear my phone and go through all the videos and um, I found it and I was so excited. So here it is. All, it, all this row is is just eight single crochet decreases. Um, they're invisible decreases and they're invisible because I'm only working into the front loop and by doing that... I get rid of the gap that would be there if I was using regular decrease stitches. I'm still using the stitch marker 